Hey guys, what's happening? Ethan here from the matlab.com. Welcome, thank you so much for watching. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the matte effect in Photoshop. This technique is really simple, really straightforward and really quick um, and it's going to look really cool as well. So if we jump over here to the layers palette, I'm just going to show you the two simple curves layers on and off again. So that's our before and after. Let me show you that again real quick so you know what we're doing. Okay, really simple. So we start with a curves layer. Okay, so hit this little half circle um, and jump down to curves there. Okay, so we get this crazy looking panel and we're just going to jump this up. See how that image is getting brighter. Now that specifically is actually getting brighter in the shadows only. And now we're going to drag this corner down. This is getting slightly darker, but in the highlights only. All right. I'm going to put a little contrast in here. Don't worry if you don't know what I'm doing. We do have other videos to do with what I'm doing here. Putting this contrast in, see how it wiggles a little. So check out the other videos on the channel. If you don't know what that is. Okay, so that's that's looking good. All right. Now, I personally would leave it there. Okay. That's my preference because I don't like going over the top with this stuff. But I know some people like a little more than that, which is fine because it's like their style, whatever. So we go to curves again. And this time, just really simple, just a little more on the shadows and a little more on the highlights. And we've got that nice bit of fade. So that's what I would have had it. That's the original. Let's go back before and after. Okay, so that's the matte effect in Photoshop. Now, if you head over to matlab.com forward slash PS, I'm going to hit you up with a bunch of really cool resources for learning Photoshop and, and doing some really cool stuff. So head on over there. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comments. Um, if you've got any requests for other tutorials, hit me up with those too. I want to hear them um, and give me a little thumbs up.